What's up you guys, Matt with Texas Edge Home Inspections. Today I want to show you how I test an air conditioning system for performance. So today I'm inspecting a home that's just over a year old and uh, so the AC should be running just fine. But what we do to check the AC's performance is we take something called a Delta T, the temperature differential between the return and the supply. Now, I do this with my thermal imaging camera at the house level, or at least I do that first. I do this because I wanna know what it feels like down here in the house where these buyers are going to be living. So, let's see what we get today. Here's the return, and we are going to take a temperature, and that's looking like about 77 degrees. Now, ideally, you would find the first supply register off of the unit and take a temperature reading from there. However, that's hard to determine from inside the house. So usually, especially on a small house like this, I'll just run around taking temperatures at every single one of them and see which one's the coldest. This one right here gives me a reading of 65. To be considered performing and functioning properly, that delta T needs to be between 15 and 20 degrees. So since we had 77 at the return and 65 at the supply, that's about a difference of about 12 degrees, and that's definitely under the mark. Now, usually what you probably should do is take a temperature at the unit with a probe thermometer. This system that I do works for me every time. However, whenever I get something that's just close like this, uh, uh, just underperforming, uh, I do go up into the attic and take some probe temperatures. So let me show you what I got today. So when I took probe thermometer temperatures at the attic, I was able to get a delta T of 13 degrees, which is only one degree different, but still very much underperforming. Again, the acceptable range is going to be between 15 and 20 degrees, 15 being acceptable, but really on the low end, 20 being optimal. Uh, anything above 20 can also possibly be not functioning properly. Uh, but today, no matter where you took your temperatures, we're not getting enough to be able to consider this functioning. This is likely due to some type of refrigerant, a uh, lack of refrigerant, uh, possibly a leak. I'm not real sure, but my job is to report that it is not functioning and recommend further evaluation by a licensed HVAC specialist. Okay, guys, I'm glad to have found this today on this year, year and a half old home so the buyers can possibly get this fixed before they move in because it's about to get hot in Texas. Matt with Texas Edge Home Inspections. I'm going to go finish inspecting this property. Give me a call so I can inspect you. your next house. Bye now. Hey, you guys. Thanks for watching. Please feel free to like and share. And if you'd like to see more of my videos, head on over to YouTube and hit subscribe.